It's Katie from Crazy Maisie Creations. Welcome to Maisie's Monday Picks. And uh, there she is. May May, come here. You want to say hi? Come here. Oh, my good girl. Oh, how are you guys? Happy Monday. Happy, happy Monday, guys. All right. Say hi to everyone. Say welcome. It's a new week. All right. Let's click on this. All right. Oh, I didn't get water. All right. So if you're on here, I want you to come in. Say hello. Tell me how gorgeous your weather is. It is stinking fabulous outside. There's a breeze, but it's a hot one. It's it's not. Um, is it? What are you? What are you doing, crazy? Crazy, what are you doing? What is it you're doing? But it is gorgeous outside. So after, I'm going to put you down. Can I put you down for a minute? Did you say hi to everyone? Okay, say hi to everyone. You go in your bed. Go night night. Okay. All right, let me just pull up the live here. Let's see what we got going on. There we go. All right. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Susan. Hey, JoJo. What's going on, girl? Ah, uh, hey Jackie, hey Joan, hey Dana, hey Rosemary. Oh, thank you. This is in my shop. Um, uh, hey Chrissy, it's hot, hot, hot in New York and in Philadelphia. Apparently, I would assume so. We kind of have the same kind of weather. All right, so it's Monday. It's a fresh start to our week. Maisie was a little sluggish. I gotta be honest. She woke up this morning saying, "Mama, I don't think I want to start the day this early." It was a long weekend. We had um, a tremendous amount of fun during this past weekend. We had the clubby Christmas in July weekend. It was a huge success. And I'm so stinking proud of each and every one of those designers. They knocked it out of the park. If you guys have not seen the live, because you were busy this weekend working outside, gardening, whatever it was, um, go check out the schedule. It's posted in uh, Crazy Maisie Creation. And check out all the designers. Go watch the replay. Go like, follow. Go spread the love for each of them. They're stinking fabulous. Seriously. No joke. Hey, Christine. Hey, Tracy. Hey, Georgie. Hey, Joy. Hey, Courtney. Vacation on Pawley Island where the temperature feels like, oh, my Lord, 104. I would be in the water. I would be in the water just soaking at 104. Hey, Becky. How are you, girl? All right. So let me put in my links. Okay, and let me pin that so you guys know where to find all my goodies. All right, here we go. Here we go. Going to be 95. Bonnie, that is too hot for me. Okay, so other than going outside to walk my, my bubbies, Clancy and Maisie, I have to go grocery shopping today, so I will be outside to go to the store and to come back in. Other than that, I'm not leaving the house. I mean... Central air is where it's at, seriously. All right, guys. So if you watched me um, last night, I was trying to get Melissa on. We were trying to do a split screen. We got it to work, though, um, on our personal pages. So apparently you can't do it on your business pages. We did learn that. Um, so you saw me. I had three projects I was going to work on last night. So I figured, why not come on today? Because Maisie was a little sluggish. She didn't feel like, you know, picking out ribbons and mesh and all that fun stuff. She, hey, Bonnie Burns. Hey, Tracy. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. So she was like, Mama, just whatever's on your table, just design that. And I was like, you got it. You take it easy. You rest in bed, girl. Um, so that's what we're going to do. We might finish up a few of those projects today. Um, what else? I want to remind all of you, 11 days. That's it for the month of July. It's all we have left. Christmas in July is going to be over in 11 days. If you've been wanting a doodle caddy, perfect tails, or any fabulous things in my shop, Definitely, definitely go in there, crazymazycreation.com or my Etsy shop. Go in there, use the code July25. You only have 11 days. 11 days. Scott Waterman is in the house with 500 stars. Happy birthday, my friends. He had a birthday yesterday, guys. If you don't know Scott Waterman, you're missing out. He is a terrific, terrific guy. Um, He had a birthday. He did. And he gave away a lot of fun stuff yesterday. Hey, Christy. Hey, Bonnie. I said yesterday, um, Scott, if, I guess you didn't hear it, if you came on my live yesterday, or one of my lives, I was live like three times yesterday, I was going to sing you happy birthday, but you never came on. 
So you missed out on my vocals singing you happy birthday. Yep. Hey, Robin. How are you? Hey, Kathy. All right, let's get going. Um, Please pray for my precious daddy, 77. Oh, absolutely, Kathy. Sending you lots of prayers and a big hug from New York. Stay strong, girl. All right, let's get going because I have a lot going on. A lot going on. All right, so we started this one last night, this elf guy. Okay, he's on a pine wreath frame. Okay, but I want to add... We did one bow. I want to add a few more bows to this sucker. Okay. So we have this gorgeous four inch. This came from Deco Exchange. You can go hit um, shoplikemazy.com and that will bring you into Deco Exchange. Thank you, Becky. I appreciate you, girl. All right. Um, what is the other ribbon we used? We used the red and we used this. Okay. So we're going to make some hand bows. Hey, Maxwell. How are you? Hey, Faye. Hey, Melissa. You guys spread the love spread the love because you never know when happy mail is gonna be given out you just don't know it's at any given time all right this gorgeous ribbon right here is fabulous i love working with four or five inch ribbon okay i think it's a great pop to a bow girl i'm sorry i crashed for a few hours yesterday i uh it was fabulous sorry i missed you girl don't even worry don't even worry i'm about like i'm like girl don't even worry, Scott. It's all good. You have been burning the candle at both ends. Rocking it. You have, have you, have you guys seen his lives? Like he's up to like 3,000 people on a live. It's nuts. Absolutely nuts. All right. We're going to make these approximately five to six inches. Okay. Our loops. And we're just going to make quick, easy, simple bows. Look how gorgeous that ribbon is. You guys see that? It's fabulous, okay? And I'm not having long tails at all. They're approximately five inches, my tails. Hey, Dolores, how are you? Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I'm exhausted. I got to tell you, though, we had such a fun weekend with the marathon that sitting there watching marathons for two days, watching lives for two days, you don't realize how, like, tiring that is you know I was working the whole time too I was down here I created new kits um what else did I do I did a lot of work got stuff in my shop took pictures I don't know how righties cut I swear it is so difficult for me to cut righty I'm like a, a three-year-old trying to cut straight with my right hand oh geez Louise oh there we go okay it's not the best on my way to Dr. Swain, have a great day, replay. Oh, Shirley, good luck at the doctors, girls. I appreciate you. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Katie. I love having another Katie on here. Thank you for spreading the love from North Carolina. All right, so we don't have much of this. Let's see how much we can get from this. I'm gonna come from behind. Okay, and we're just gonna add it right into my fingers. Right in there. Hey, Pamela. Hey, Michelle, how are you? Hey, Amy. Okay. So, what plans do you guys have for this week? Do we have goals? I'm very big on Monday mornings. This is when I do my paperwork for my private design group. This is where I plan things. You know, I set up my schedule. Usually my schedule for the month is done, but, you know, things happen. Other things come up. So, Mondays are my day. Pay bills, you know, banking, all that kind of stuff for the business. I do all that. On Mondays all kinds of paperwork I probably could go a little bigger with the tail but that's gonna work for now I think we're good there all right um, so my goals for this week I got to try and get I have two kits done already okay oh that gnome kit guys if you do not belong to the crafty club market that free private group that Melissa and Doreen and myself have please go join it's free like I said F R E E free um, I just launched. Remember the gnome kit I did last week? Well, I have those plushies back and the kit, and it's gorgeous. Michelle with 50 stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you for the stars. Did I not sing Scott? A thank you for the stars. Scott, I apologize, my friend. I'm going to sing this to you and Michelle. 
Thank you for the stars. Thank you for the stars. I'm a little tired. I'm, I have to say I'm a little sluggish like like uh, Maisie. A little sluggish today. But I thank you both for the stars. Thank you very much. All right. So we're just making a simple, simple hand bow to put here. So we have one here. I want to put one here, and then I want to put another one on the other side. So we're actually going to make two of these. Hey, Tony, how are you? Hey, Patricia. Guys, thank you so much for spreading the love. I do appreciate it. Let's make sure our loops are the same. So far, taking care of my 97-year-old mom. Her aide quit. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. But you know what? I'm sure she'd rather have you than the aide. I'm sure of that. All right. Let's cut that. Did I grab pipe cleaners before I came on? I don't think so. Let's grab some pipe cleaners. All right. We're going to put a pipe cleaner around this. I have, oh, I missed your plans there, girl. Take some pictures of new signs for the shop. Start organizing paperwork. Awesome, Michelle, awesome. Mondays just seems like a great, you know, like start, you know, to the week. Like, you wanna get up and get going. But I'm tired today. I am, and I have so much to do today, so much. So I was telling you about that kit. That kit, if you guys go into Crafty Club Market, You'll get all the information regarding that kit. And they get exclusive first looks. I did a live in there um, earlier this morning showing them everything and um, telling them about the new things that are going to be going on. So definitely go to the Crafty Club Market. It's a free private group. And that dovetail is no bueno. My dovetails have to be on point or they do not leave my shop. That's better. Okay. Katie, is the one and a half glitter ribbon? Yes, that's one and a half inch glitter ribbon. If so, do you buy it more than three yards? This came from a 50 yard roll. This was a 50 yard roll. And I got it last year. I want to say Deco Exchange. I don't know if they still have it in. No bueno. I got to fix that. Um, I don't know if they still have it in stock, if they got it back, but go check out shoplikemazy.com. Is it, I get confused, is it shop like Maisie or shop with Maisie? Hmm, Becky, do you know that answer? What did I just say? I'm, I'm telling you, I'm tired, guys. I am a tired today. Hey, Kimber. I go to sleep and wake up singing. Oh my God, so do I. I drive my husband crazy, but I love it. Because it makes me happy. All right, so we're going to have another one. We're going to put it right here. All right. Katie, Waterman's Loft Affiliate. Thank you, I appreciate that. You guys, if you saw that black and white mesh that I used in my design. Did I use it over the weekend? I can't remember. Um, that came from Waterman's Loft. Yep. Did you see the angels? I made an angel wreath that came from Waterman's Loft as well. Um, so just click that affiliate link. You don't know what Scott might have in store, what he has in stock. Thank you. I don't like two and a half inch glitter ribbon. Sometimes it's too much. I'm picky. Okay. That's what makes you you. I get it. No worries. I love glitter ribbon in any size. Any, any size. Hey, Jeanette. How are you, girl? Hey, Gertie from Newfoundland. How are you? What is the time over in Newfoundland? What time is it there? Oh, my God, from Nova Scotia. Hey, Barbara from Nova Scotia. What time is it in Nova Scotia? I love it. Newfoundland and Nova Scotia. Hey, clubbies at lunch. Hey, Antoinette. Shared and sprinkled love. Thank you, Robin. I appreciate you, girl. Thank you, Scott. My brother from another mother. Thank you, my friends. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, what was I just going to say? How many of you, let's see, how many of you 
have your tickets already for the Crafters Convention for 2021. Let me see some hearts. Oh my God, 3.40. Oh, that's not bad, p.m. Same as, what time is it here? Two o'clock? Oh, that's not bad. I left a tag on this wreath. I need to take it off. Okay, we're gonna make one more of this gorgeousness. I just think for the holidays, you just gotta, you know, just be free and let everything sparkle and shine. I just love it. Okay, so we have our second one. Now we're gonna put one more right about here in this area, okay? Another hand bow. Hey, Jessica, how are you? Hey, Ann Parker, what's happening? Did I miss the hearts? Did I miss the hearts? You guys, seriously, not one of you have a ticket to the Crafters Convention for 2021? You're nuts. You are nuts because you're missing out. All right, we're going to do one more of these bows. I have not missed it yet since Scott started. I have not. Every year... He does it. He gets better and better and better. He always outdoes himself each year. All right, again, our loops. I cannot believe. Uh, hey, Catherine. Uh, Scott's the bomb, man. Scott is, and I say it all the time, he's my brother from another mother. There are some hearts. You guys, if you don't know about the Crafters Convention, it is a convention um, that is hosted by Scott Warneman from Design with Scott. He is stinking fabulous, super talented. And he puts on such a great convention. It's not only just design, it's business. It's a lot of fun, great networking, okay? Um, I Like I said, I've gone every year. There's Bonnie Burns, there's Ashley. Where is, it's in Illinois. So, um, Becky, if you want to put in the website that people can go check out and grab their tickets, it's, I'm telling you, it's stinking a good time. So, let me tell you. If you're just starting out your business, okay, and I say this all the time, the best thing I ever did for my business was go to Wreath Makers Live, which is like a crafters convention, okay? The best thing I ever did was the network and the friends and the relationships I made has catapulted my business to another level, okay? And that's something you can't put a price on. That's something that you can't buy in a store, you know, the relationships and the friendships and the network and the business people you meet. It's just... I, I can't even tell you how, and I say it all the time, the people that I've met at these conventions are fabulous. You have some of the most important, well-known people in the industry at the conventions. And Scott is, he has the best of the best there, you know. He does not scrimp on anything, on anything. The convention is in the same hotel. It's just a great fun time. It really is such a great fun time. So if you haven't, go check it out. Becky's going to put the link in here. Holy moly, I only have a little bit of this ribbon. So we're going to use this as a tail. Listen, that's what you do. You adapt and excel. So do, I don't think I have any more of this. No. Nope. So we're going to adapt and we're going to excel on this. Use it as a tail. Yeah, Katie, check it out. It's a lot of fun. It really is a lot of fun. Okay. Hey, Sandra Gregory. How are you, sweet thing? I used your uh, pines yesterday promoting General Wholesale in my live. I bought pines from her last year that I used in a Christmas design during my marathon yesterday. How are you, sweet thing? Thank you. I appreciate that. I'm super excited to go to sit in the clubby gallery. Oh, my God. And cheer Katie as she is one of the designers. Thank you, Bonnie Burns. I love that. The clubby gallery. We're going to have to do that. Clubby guy. I gotta write that down or I'll totally forget that. Hey, Shari Barnes, how are you, girl? I miss you. All right, so we don't have all this ribbon, but that's okay, because I'm gonna move this bow over to here and we're gonna put this one in here. And we're gonna adapt and excel, like I've, I've said. You know, that's just what we do. We just adapt and excel. Awesome. So Becky put in the Crafters Convention information in... Uh, the comments. Guys, definitely go check it out. It is 
I'm telling you, a fun time. If you want to see pictures from last year's, I have them in my uh, Crazy Amazing Creation page. Check them out. Melissa and I went with Melissa from Burlap Boutique, and we had a blast. We had a blast. We always have a good time. All right. Yes, welcome all the new members. Thank you. My name is Katie. I am the owner and creator of Crazy Mazy Creations. I thank you for coming in and hanging out this afternoon, kicking off our Monday, the start of our week. Um, if you wouldn't mind, please like, follow, and spread the love. I would appreciate it. Because every time you spread the love, it gives you an opportunity to win some what? Happy mail. That's right. I am a happy mail giver away. -er. I am. I love giving back to the community and to my followers. So that's what I do. All right. Where is... Did I take on... Oh, there we go. Pipe cleaner right there. Hey, Janice. Love watching Scott for the... Wait. Hi, Katie. Loved watching Scott for the first time. He made a candy cane, and I did tons of them. I know those candy canes, I know, are fabulous. But the thing is, see, we do them on the lives because there's a lot of newcomers that have never seen them. You know, even though we've been doing them for years, and you see some of us designers doing them, you know, that's why we do them like that. Hey, Rachel. How are you, girl? Hey, Norma. Yes, Happy Mail. You got to love Happy Mail, right? This four inch ribbon makes my heart happy. It makes my heart really happy. All right. All right, so I'm gonna remove this one from here. Okay, and we're gonna move it over to the other side. And we're gonna put this one in here. I have friends to share this with. Love your work. Oh, thank you, Norma. I appreciate you. Okay, did I undo it? No, still tied in there. If I could see what I'm doing, it would really help me a lot. <laughs> Let me tell you, hitting 51, hmm, it's not all that I, I was supposed to be. But, let me tell you, I wouldn't, change it for the world. I feel like I'm 30. I mean, my bones don't, but mentally I do. Katie, I'm doing good. How are you and your family? I'm usually here just a little late. Shari, no worries, girl. I miss you, though. Shower the power for you. Oh, my God. Showered the power for you. I like that, too. Bonnie Burns, you are on, like, a, a real uh, roll right now. You got Clubby Gallery. All right, we're taking that one out. We're moving this one in. Okay, I'm going to sit this one just a little bit higher because it has less ribbon in it. So I want it noticed a little bit more. So I'm going to bring it up just a little bit. Okay, and these are like some of the tips and tricks like I teach in my group because you don't want it to get lost in the wreath. You want it to be just as noticed and prominent as that other bow. Hey, Ann, I'm new from Brandon. Is that Mississippi? Yep. I will be following for sure. Thanks, Scott, for sharing your site. Thanks, my brother from another mother. I love Scott. I do, I do, I do. I love him. He is such a great and, and caring guy. He's very giving. Hey, Johnny. Hey, Eloise. Thank you guys so much for spreading the love. I appreciate you. Every now and then, my brain wakes up. <laughs> All right. So, guys, you see how I didn't have enough of that one polka dot ribbon? So, instead of freaking out, I'm like, oh, my God, my wreath is ruined. No, it's not. We just adapt and excel, and we just make it happen, okay? We just switch it up. Okay. There we go. That four-inch ribbon is everything. Now we got a dovetail. I have not dovetailed yet. So dovetailing or angling your ribbons are very important. It is like the finish um, look to your design. If you do not, to me, it's just unkept. It's like walking out of your bedroom with your bed unmade, okay? Honestly, that is no bueno, okay? I don't like that. Uh, you got to take pride in your work, guys. Whether it's you just hanging in on your front door as a hobby, you're making wreaths as a hobby, or you're selling them. Look at, isn't that so much better? 
having that dovetail, it's just a nicer finished look, okay? Just think of it again as you walking out of your bedroom and not making your bed, okay? That's really what it's like. This is going to be over the top when you complete it. Ah, thanks, Cindy. So I started it last night, and usually on a Monday I'll do a new design, but honestly, Maisie was just exhausted. <laughs> and I'm a little sluggish as well. So we were like, you know what, let's just finish up what we started last night. All right, so now we're gonna place that other bow back over on this side. Okay, so this is what we have so far. And we're gonna come back over here. Now I like to work in three, so this will be our last bow in here. And then we're gonna add some greeneries in here as well. Told Scott happy birthday yesterday and wish him, I did text him yesterday. I don't know if he got my text, but I did test text my brother. I texted him, I was gonna sing happy birthday, but you know. Hey Emily, how are ya? To back Jones for winning decorative. Wait, wait. Oh Becky. Oh Becky, you won the Did I know that? I think I did know that. Alright. That's awesome. Becky Jones in this community, she is a listen, I can't even tell you. Becky Jones is like gold. She is like gold in this community. If you have not met Becky, you're missing out there again. She is truly, truly one of the nicest people in this community. Hey, Cecilia, how are you? He is awesome in every way. And let me tell you, he's rocking his lives. People are like noticing him. And like, I've known him for a long time. I knew he was fabulous from the get-go. You know, but now there's people all over this community noticing how stinking ta talented and fabulous he is. All right, so that's what we got. I love, love, love Christmas design. I'm going to cut that one a little shorter because I don't like it hanging in his face like that. I don't want to take away from the sign. I bet you guys are a hoot when you're all together. Hmm. I can, listen, I can't tell secrets. Did you guys see, we did a live, Scott and I, with a bunch of other people from the New York, um, what was it, what is it called? The New York, Gal oh, I can't think of the name, it's in September. We did a live the night before, we were in our hotel room, Scott was designing just from whatever stuff he had brought with him. We were live for like three hours, it was so much fun, we had so many laughs in his hotel room, so funny. All right, so I'm gonna cut a few of these, I'm gonna trim them, just a bit, they're a bit too long for me, okay? So I'm just gonna trim them off, that's so much better. I don't like when signs are covered, okay? I'll do this one as well. You can roll them if you want, you can bend, like fold them, do like an accordion fold on them, if you would like. Pearl, pearl, um, why am I drawing a blank? All right, there we go. What do you guys think? Isn't it cute? All right, I feel like we need a little love down here, okay? Feeling some ribbon tails we gotta do. All right, so let's grab, we're gonna make some cheater bows, okay? So do you guys know what cheater bows are? I'm gonna use my perfect tails, okay? Perfect tails from burlapboutique.com. I'm gonna make cheetah bows maybe 28 inches. So this is a 14 inch ribbon tail. She is the original. Melissa Freeman from Burlap Boutique is the original designer of, of the tails. If you see something else that says tails on it, it's not the original. Melissa from Burlap Boutique is the original. And let me tell you guys, I can't say a word, but she has something up her sleeve. Ooh, wait, just wait. And don't forget guys, in her shops, July 25. So in my shop, in Melissa's shop, in Doreen's shop, you save 25% on everything in the shop. All right, so this is a cheetah bow, okay? We're gonna make another one. Let's do another one. Because I wanna have some tails. Hey, Lisa Brown, thank you. Let's do some cheetah bows. Thank you guys for spreading love. I'm feeling like we should do some Happy Mail in a moment. 
That's what I'm feeling. Okay. All right, so we're gonna do another one. I'll flip this around. I like having the long tails. Now you can make them any size you want. I'm just gonna reverse them. Okay, so we have a tail, tail, loop. Okay, it's an easy way to make a bow, guys. If you don't have the hand strength or anything to make a bow, this is a nice, easy way to make a bow. And they're called cheetah bows. I might cut those tails down. They might be a little too long for me. We might go to 13 inches. Okay, let's bring this in. So this is how I design, guys. I look at my wreath as I'm going. I come up with a concept. So my concept was having the elf head, okay? I don't design it in my head. I'm not one of those designers. I design as I go. It's just how I roll, you know? Um, I wish it could be, you know, different, but it just happens, you know? So I love doing it on a evergreen pine because what's great about that, you have a twist tie no matter where you look. There's a twist tie. Scott is hilarious. He sure is. Did you finally get you some dinner? No, I did not eat dinner last night. I was so tired last night, honestly. I just went to bed. I had um, Jello, and I couldn't even finish the Jello. I was so tired. So, love that. So, we're going to alternate between this ribbon and that other ribbon to put in. Oops, I dropped that. Okay, so there's our cheater bow. We're gonna put a few of these in. All right. Let's do this ribbon as well. You guys, thank you so much for spreading the love. I appreciate it. I so appreciate it, guys. All right, so we're gonna do another, I know we're gonna do 13 inch. See what's great about these, they come in all different sizes. She has the perfect tails, she has the 11 inch, she has the tiny tails, she has the mini tails. Ooh, and I can't even tell you what she's coming out with. Uh, you guys know me, like I can keep a secret. If someone says, Katie, please don't say anything. Listen, my these lips, shut. But just know that I'm biting really down hard on my tongue that it's bleeding, because I am so dying to tell you guys. But just keep your eyes open in the next couple of weeks. That's all I've got to say about that. Okay? That's all. Oh, my God, girl. You need to eat during the day. Yes, I know. In fact, I have to go to the grocery store after this live. And uh, I have to get some rotisserie chicken. That's what my, my babies eat. Clancy and Maisie, they eat kibble but they won't eat it without some rotisserie chicken in it. So they're spoiled. So they get a little rotisserie chicken every night and they get um, some scrambled eggs every morning. I know, spoiled, right? Spoiled, spoiled, spoiled. I can't keep a secret. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. I'm sure you can. Not that I ever told you a secret, I don't think. Have I ever told you a secret, Scott? I don't think so, but I'm sure you can. If a friend told you not to say a word, I believe that you could keep that secret. I believe it. All right, let's do this thing. I'm gonna put another one right over here. Where's the other one? Right over there. Okay, so we're gonna go right across from that one, and we're gonna add this one right on in. I have a small hand, wait, I have small hands and I think those cheetah bows would be easier for me to make. Yes, and if you can't hold it in your hand, I'll show you. If you have a bow dabber or a foreign one or um, an easy bow maker, anything, or a chip clip even, okay? Just lay them in there and they would be, I mean, so much easier than holding it in your hand. Now I have MS, so my hands, they do hurt. I get a lot of zooming in my arms and my hands and my legs, so to hold, all the ribbon, like if I was using like seven or eight, nine ribbons, there's no way, you know, um, I could do it. But like two or three, I can hold them. They're bearable. But I totally get it when people say I have arthritis or I have this, I have that. I can't hold it. I totally understand it. I get it, girl. There we go. Okay, so we're just going to dovetail these. But it's a it's an easy way to make a bow. 
you know. A lot of beginners in my private group, we have Fun Day Bo Sunday. So every Sunday we go live in my group and I do like, we slow everything down. I zoom in on my hands. You see my hand placement, how I'm twisting the ribbon, how I'm folding it, um, how I'm holding it, which is very important. How I'm putting the wire in or the pipe clean, whatever I'm using. Um, so a lot of people, especially newbies, um, they don't like making bows. You know, they have a hard time. So um, we show them how to do that on Fun Day Bow Sunday. So I save all these little scraps for our teeny because I don't know what she's doing with it, but she's doing something fabulous with it. Angela with 50 stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for the stars. I appreciate you. I need a drink of water. Lord, I'm thirsty. Mm-hmm. I need that little burst of energy. All right, let's go back to this ribbon. All right. And we're going to do them. We changed it to 13 inches, so we're going to make them 26 inches. All right. Cut. We'll do another one since we're going to do two. Why am I not scrolling? Why am I not scrolling? Oh, my goodness. I do the same thing. I give them the same. Katie, how cool is that? If I learned you'd give a bag of food. Oh, that's so funny. You do the same thing to your dogs. He's hysterical. He really is hysterical. Where can I order the perfect tails? Uh, Bethany at burlapboutique.com. Burlapboutique.com. Okay? That's where you can get the perfect tails. Hey, Ivy, how are you? Is Melissa on here? I think Melissa's on here. So if you have any questions about uh, Burlap Boutique or the Perfect Tales, Melissa, I believe, is on here. She can answer any of your questions about them. Uh, I need help making bows. Girl, I can help you, Deborah. I love making bows. My two favorite things are making bows and putting together wreath kits. I love it. All right. So... I'm going to put one of these towards the top to fill in up here. Do you usually use two and a half inch ribbon on all your tails? No. Um, I switch it up. I've used one and a half. I've used um, one inch. But typically on an average, yes. Two and a half inch ribbon and one and a half inch ribbon are usually the go-to but I have not always done that I'm not a rule follower I do what I feel in the moment and that's usually how I rock um, and if people don't like it they don't like it I feel that if it's pleasing to my eye there's someone else in this world because that's how Etsy is your shop is on Etsy I mean I have my own website but I put these on Etsy as well Etsy covers the world not just the United States the world there's got to be someone else out there that has, that likes it as much as I do, right? That's how I look at things. Not everyone is going to like everything you do. And that's okay. That's what makes us us, you know, individuals, originals, you know. I'm good with that. Listen, I can take criticism if it's given in a nice way. If they if someone says to me, oh, Katie, I don't like that. Is, what, you put those colors together? Oh, my God. Katie, what are you thinking? That's a little rude. But if someone said to me, oh, that's not really my taste. I love it, but it's not really my taste. I'm good with that. It's just the way you say it. You know what I mean? So, and I get it. Not everything is for everyone. And that is okay. Some people, they'll text me and like, you talk too much. Get to the project. I'm like, listen, hit that X because I'm not changing. I am who I am and it's going to continue the way it is. You don't like my lives? Don't watch. No one, listen, I didn't put a gun to your head to watch my live, did I? You came on yourself. I don't know why I got to leave nasty comments. Hey, Ann Nichols, how you feeling, girl? Um, I used to never be able to make a bow. I had the Bodabra and now the Easy Bow Maker. I do have arthritis and nerve damage in my hand. Finally, after making all the designer's videos, I got... Yay! Jeanette, that's awesome! All right. So, look. Look how cutie patooties. Now... This does not say Christmas anywhere on it. doesn't say Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. But you look at this sucker, and what does it say? It says Christmas. It sure does, shorty. 
All right, I want to put in some greeneries. I want to put in some greeneries. Where are my greeneries? I know I have them here. Oh, right behind me. Okay, so here's my bucket from the weekend of my greeneries. All right, and I want to add a few. We're going to add a few pines to this. I don't need that anymore. I don't need my ribbon anymore. That can go over there. Let's turn on my glue pot while I prep this. I don't need this anymore. Thank you, Melinda. I appreciate you. I got flock flying everywhere. Flock is flying. Okay, got my glue pot on, finally. Let me put these away. And we are going to make this gorgeous. We're going to add some greeneries. Because I'm always trying to show you guys dimension, texture, and color. Okay? So, I want to add, this is both texture, right? This is both color, and it will give you dimensions. Okay, so I'm going to get all three out of one item. So when you're shopping, you know, for a wreath or something that you want to design, it doesn't matter if you're cutting hair, if you're making a sundae, baking a cake, or doing a flower arrangement, or making a wreath, it doesn't matter. If you're a designer, an artist, those are the three main things you want to have in your design. Texture, color, dimension, okay? Very important to design. Kathy with the stars, thank you for the stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for the stars. Listen, I never said I was the best dancer. You know what I'm saying? But I will have the most fun. I'll tell you that right now. Okay. Hey, Christina, how are you? Katie, how are Yvonne and Charles? Um, Jojo, I will private message you. And I forgot that I had to private message you also about something else. What was the other thing? Um, oh, I know what you want, the address. Okay, so let's prep a few of these. Um, when I get back from the grocery store, JoJo, I will give you all that information, girl. Okay, we're gonna grab some greeneries out of my little bucket here. So I keep all my stuff in my wee shed. For the newcomers, I got a huge wee shed outside that I just got back in February, but we couldn't do anything with it because it was cold here in New York, winter. And um, so we just threw stuff in there. So Doodles was, Doodles, my husband, I call him Doodles. He was off for the past two weeks from work and he built shelves in there. Oh my God. So now when I want to design, I could just put Christmas down on the floor and I just pulled things. So I just pulled my bucket. I can go put it back in the front. It, life is so much easier the way he did it. And I love it. Love it. What are the stars? How do you do them? Rachel. Stars are something Facebook gave my page and people started um, buying them. They give me a penny. Every time I get a star, I get a penny, which I know people are thinking, oh my God, so cheap at Facebook because they make money too. But listen, I've raised over $400 on stars that I'm giving to the Alzheimer's Association. Every star that is given to me, 100% of it goes to the Alzheimer's Association. Not just that, that $400 my mom and Doodles and myself match and are doubling it. So every time, just know that it's going to, I'm not keeping it, I'm not, you know, buying product with it, it's going 100% to the Alzheimer's Association. All right, I need, what I need now is my stem cutter. You guys, I don't know if Damon has the stem cutter in stock, um, but if he does, please go to my um, affiliate, Shop Like Maisie, Dot com. Go in there. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Buy this sucker. Especially during Christmas time, you're going to need it for these thick stems. Okay? If you have hand issues like we spoke about. I don't know if Scott has this in it. This, Becky, does Scott have uh, the stem cutter in his shop? I don't know. Becky. Oh, look at all the stars. Susie, Marina, and Nichols. Thank you for all the stars. Thank you for all the stars. It just gets me so happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you guys for the stars. I appreciate you all. Um, I don't know if Scott has them, but I have an affiliate for Scott. But I know Damon sold the stem cutter out of um, his shop. I don't know if he still has it in stock or not, but I'm telling you, you're going to need it. These are the greeneries from wholesale, from uh, General Wholesale. Um, Damon has them. Okay. So go to shoplikeamazie.com. That will bring you right into the shop. And that's my affiliate. I appreciate you using it. 
And look how stink it easy. I have MS. I have heart. I can hardly, you know, use my hands. I mean, I can use my hands. I don't want. I can use my hands, but I can't do stems like that. If I use my my wire cutter, it, seriously, I cannot get it down through there. This stem cutter is a lifesaver. A lifesaver. I love it. Okay, so we're breaking these apart. I want to break this one apart as well. Bruno, he says, what about Happy Mail? We're going to do Happy Mail. We're going to do Happy Mail. It's all good. Happy Mail, Bruno from Cork, Ireland. Happy Mail. Just got my clubby trivia Happy Mail. Oh, awesome, Ashley. Ashley, we do a trivia. So I don't pick any of the clubbies here on my live because um, that wouldn't be fair. You know what I mean? So we do a trivia every Sunday in my group, and I give away Happy Mail in there. All right, so I'm going to need a few more of these. So let's put some of these in there because these are a little glitter funness. Whoopsie. There we go. That is going to lighten it up just a bit. Okay. Let's clip, clip some of these. Hey, Nancy, how are you? Thanks, guys, for spreading the love. I appreciate it. I appreciate you all. I love your... Listen, that happy star dance changes depending. You know, you never know what I'm going to do. Okay, I am just cutting randomly. This uh, greenery that I'm using right now came last year from Michael's, I believe. Okay. And I got it, of course. I never pay full price for anything. I don't believe in it. So it has to be... I might as well use that last one, right? Okay, garbage. Let's put the stem cutter back. And let's get to making this gorgeous. Gorgeous, I say. All right, let's put that back. Make some room on here. Okay, move the uh, dabber back. And let's do happy mail. Have you guys been spreading the love? If you've been spreading the love, you're going to get some happy mail. You, your name may be picked. Let's do it, guys. Happy mail. Let's get the happy mail book. And my happy mail pen. <gasps> Where's the happy mail pen? We'll use... Where's my happy mail pen? I don't know where it went. All right. Happy mail. Okay, you have to be on to win happy mail. Remember, guys, okay? You have to be on. Let's see. Let's, let's, blah, 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 let's see. Bethany Cooper. Bethany Cooper. Mail me, mail me, listen to me. Private message me your mailing address, and I'm going to send you some happy mail. All right, let's get this guy all dressed up for the holidays, shall we? Let's dress him up. Okay. There we go. Let's bring it back up. We're going to do more happy mail, guys. We're going to do more happy mail. Is she on here? Let's see. Hey, Marianne. Hello again. You look cute today, like always. Gain, where is mom? I think you've locked her in the basement like JoJo's Nana. <laughs> no, she's upstairs. Is Handsome on here? Did I just see Gary? Or am I seeing things? No. I noticed you saved all the dovetail scraps. Yes, I saved them. I give them to another wreath maker. Well, she's a crafter. Teeny. Um, she, I said, she asked me to send them to her, so that's what I'm doing, and I sent her a bunch already. Look how that's going to look in there. Guys, just that touch right there, I love it. Absolutely love it. Okay, and you're probably thinking, no, no greenery. And I'm saying, yes, yes, greenery. Ow, that's my finger, and that hurts. Howdy from Texas. Hey, Jennifer. 
I love so much of your stuff. The Rita Gordon. Oh, thank you, Becky. I appreciate you, girl. So, guys, if you don't know, I go live every Monday at this time. Every Monday at at 2 o'clock. And I also go live every Wednesday night at 8. And in my private group, we go live twice a week. We go live every Tuesday at 7 p.m. And we go live every Sunday for Fun Day Bo Sunday at 2 p.m. And it's a great, great time. Sometimes you want to see the whole leaf. Sometimes you just want to see a little bit of it coming out. Hey, Deborah, first time watching. So if it's your first time watching and you like what you see, you want to see more of my designs and me creating, all you have to do is hopefully Facebook is on their game. Um, I don't like that. Let's cut this one down just a little. I don't like how it's sitting there. Um, click the screen. You're going to see three dots. Okay. In those three dots, it will say alert notifications. And hopefully, Facebook. There you go. That's better. Facebook will let you know when I go live. Perfect. Hey, Carol from Tennessee. How are you? Welcome to Crazy Maisie Creations. I appreciate you coming in. Spend the afternoon with me. We are making this gorgeous elf wreath. And this will be available in my shop later today after I take pictures of it. Okay. If someone is interested in it now, remember you get 25% off. So July 25 in both my Etsy shop and in crazymazycreation.com. And that is for Christmas in July till the end of July. I am burning the hell out of my finger because I'm not paying attention. Okay, and then we're going to put some of these pines in as well. Hey, Deborah, thank you, Scott, for, for sending Deborah. I appreciate that. And you're from PA. You're practically my neighbor. I'm here in New York. I am 30 miles north of New York City. So I'm close enough to the city, but yet far enough to stay away from all the hustle and bustle of the city. So I'm putting some around the bow as well that we've added. I feel like all of a sudden it got very cloudy. Like that's no bueno, I have to go grocery shopping. I don't want it to be cloudy. Uh, you love her Jingle Joes, right? Aren't they fabulous? Love them. Love them. Thank you, Melissa. Put your finger condoms on. Oh, yeah, I forget about them. My finger condoms. Okay, wait, hold on. I have a mess here from this weekend. Where are my finger condoms? Where are my finger condoms? Oh, my God, they're here. Oh, here they are. Oh, my God, thank you, Jessica. I appreciate you. Well, welcome, Peggy. Scott is sending all the love over today. I love it. All right, I got to put my finger condoms on. That's for my thumb, thumb, finger. If you guys don't have these little rubber things, I'm telling you, I call them my finger condoms because they protect my fingers. <laughs> and they do such a good job. One of my clubbies from my private design group sent them to me because I burn the hell out of my hands. And uh, he sent them to me. Oh, my God. Love them. Love them. So I'm using, I don't chintz on my glue, guys. You want to use a nice amount of glue when putting in any greeneries or anything into a design. Okay. I'm going to have to cut this one. I want this one a little shorter. There we go. Perfect. Deborah, thank you for the stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you for all the stars. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much for the stars. It means the world to me, guys, honestly. More than you'll ever know. I'm like, wait, why is that laying like that? There we go. I'm going to fix this one. I want you laying on top. 
Sometimes you have to maneuver the way you want it. There we go, that's how I want it. All right. I'm gonna put some down here. My finger condom fell off. There we go. Okay, put these back. Thank you, Sharon, I appreciate you, girl. Thank you so much. I have a Santa face that I never, I never could write. I'm now inspired. Yes, Deanne, do it. And when you do it, post a picture. Let me see it. Go to Crazy Maisie Creation community page. That is my free community page. Add it there. I would love to see it. Okay, we're going to come back over to this boat. I just lost my finger condom. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, I need them. We're going to come right over here. I'm going to cut this one. So I'm going to put it right into the bow, but I want it a little shorter. So I'm just going to cut right in the middle of there. Okay, and we're going to, I'm not getting rid of that bottom part. I'm still going to use it. Okay, I'm going to go under the bow with that. We're going to go right on top with this one. There we go. We put a nice amount of glue on, guys. Don't be chintzy with your glue. The worst thing you could ever do is not put enough glue on and your customer calls you going, uh, your pine cone fell off or your, your greenery fell out. I mean, if I can wire it in, I will. You know what I mean? I wire before gluing anything, okay? But greenery, you have to glue in. So you want to use the best glue you can and you want to use it, you know, you don't want to be cheap about it, you know? Because that is the worst advertisement for your business you know you want to get repeat customers okay we're coming right over here whoops I gotta come in this way let's come in this way like this there we go that's gorgeous all right we're gonna come over to the other bow we're gonna do the same thing to that bow First time watching, and I'm able to replay your live videos. Yes, if you share, well, spread the love. I'm not allowed to say share, but I do say it every once in a while. If you spread the love, it will be kept on your timeline. So you can watch this video as often as you'd like. So I'm just coming right into the bow. You guys, when you make a bow, especially at Christmas time, you want to go a little bit over the top for Christmas, you know. Embellish those bows. Don't be afraid to add... Um, embellishments to your bows okay put them right in here but just make sure you have the balance you want to have balance in your design okay I got some fuzzies on the elf's face that's no bueno okay it's important to have the balance there we go perfect Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, we're going to add a few over here. And then I think we're going to add some pines. And this sucker will be Dunzo, Gonzo. And I'll be, well, I won't be taking pictures now because it looks like it's about to rain. So if anyone is interested in this design, just email me at crazymazycreation at gmail.com. I got to go get a baseball hat. It's gonna start raining. So how many of you, when it rains, puts a baseball hat on? I know I do. Thank you, Jane. Hey, Tom Tom, how are ya? Um, did I miss someone's? Peggy, I apologize, what'd you ask? First time watching, am I able? Oh yeah, I did, I, I answered you, girl. Thank you, Rita, I appreciate that. All right, we're gonna put some greeneries in. Let me just grab one more of these. I see a spot here. I want to put it in. Hey, get off there. Let's put one more. All right. Now I'm going to add some of these greeneries. I'm going to break them up and put them around. Okay. I'm going to come right up towards his face. I'm going to put one right up in there. Oh, my, my condom came off. My finger condom. Okay. There we go. Okay, so we're going to go right around his face with these. If 
I'm missing some of the comments. I apologize, guys. But ask it again. If it's a question, I will definitely go back and and uh, read comments. That darker green around his face, already I'm loving. Okay, this one, and we'll keep this one as well. Come apart. And that's what I love about these kind of picks. They have multiple branches on them. You can do so much with them. Thank you, Sharon, for the stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you for the stars. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I gotta, I gotta, I need pom-poms. I need pom-poms. I need something for my star dance. I need some happy magic going on. All right, so we're going under his hat with this greenery. Okay, we're gonna bring that around. Let's bring that right there. There we go. That's perfect. I'm gonna do one more on the other side. Let me grab one more, cut it off this. Love these. If you guys have a chance, go to General Wholesale. They have some really great greeneries as well. I do not have an affiliate link for them, but I love them and I shop there often. I love them. They're another great place to go get a supply. If you're looking for things. All right, so we're going this way. So we wanna go in the same direction that we started with. Going right here under his ear. All right. And that darker green is going to just pop the rest of the design. Love that. See how that, the white, it's not really white, this is like a light green. It's kind of like this kind of green, but it's not showing on camera very well. It's just making it pop. Love it. I'm going to put a few more pieces of that right in here. And I'm going to make them a little smaller. Whoopsie. Okay. Are you guys working on Christmas in July? Have you broken out all your Christmas decorations for your designs? It's a lot, right? It's July, it's 90 degrees, and you're thinking Christmas, right? It's crazy. Absolutely nuts. Hey, Andrea Sprinkle, how are you? A megaphone and pom-poms. Yes, that's what I need. Because I need to go... I need, Like, when I see stars, literally, I want to cry inside. Because I'm just so touched how thoughtful everyone is. And, um... I just want to scream from like, I want to climb to the roof of my house and just scream and like dance for joy, you know, but I can't. So I need like pom-poms or something. Okay, let's see. Oh, we got to do this one. We didn't do this one. I knew I missed something along the lines here. I'm going to put these in. There we go. All right, this is a cutie patootie. I'm gonna put one more right over here. All right, okay, we need one more coming out under the bow. So I need some balance. And there we got it. Perfect. All right. Take those glue spiders off. Glue spiders. No bueno. All right, guys. What do we think? Love. Love, love, love. This I will definitely take pictures of. I'll put it in my shop. But I'm glad I got this one done. So cute! Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Absolutely agree. I feel the same way when people donate. Or I know. I just want to dance. 
Thank you, Debbie. Thank you, Kay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I know Gwendolyn, right? Is he not cute? He's so stinking cute. I know. So stinking cute. Okay, I am flocked everywhere, but I'm going to go to the grocery store. I'm flocked out. I am. I'm, I, I, listen, it is what it is. I am a wreath designer, and if people don't get it, that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. You know what I'm looking for? I had, which I don't know what I did. Oh, here it is. I keep everything. Like, I don't throw anything away, guys. I keep all my scraps. Like, I have, like, a bin of these, Okay. Now, these are my winter ones. They're not really Christmas. I have other ones that are Christmas, but this is my winter, and I have, like, a really big bag of winter scraps. But if you don't throw them away because you never know. You can make an arrangement. Honestly, with filler, use these as filler. I don't throw. You can ask my clubbies, my private group members. They know I don't throw anything away, okay? All right, guys. This is our design. This was Maisie's Monday pick because she's a little sluggish, but he's a cutie. Is he not? I'm going to take pictures of him. I'm going to put him in my Etsy shop. If you guys want him, remember to use the code JULY25. That is good for another 11 days. On everything in my Etsy shop and my website, okay, crazyamazingcreation.com, except apparel. T-shirts, sweatshirts, it's the only thing that doesn't come off, but it comes off wreath kits, signs, wreaths, anything I have going on in there. Save 25% off for the next 11 days, guys. I appreciate you. I want to thank Scott for sending all his friends over to hang out with me this afternoon. You guys, catch me Wednesday night at 8 p.m. We'll be doing something else that's going to be lots of fun. All right, guys. Scott, I hope you continue with that birthday fun, okay? I'll talk to you guys soon, and thanks again. Spread a little love, guys. Have a great day. Bye.